faith. You know, when we look into the people of faith in the Bible, we see Abraham, he's called a person of faith. He believed God and was counted righteous. We look into Noah, you know, when you look into Hebrews 11, we find different people of faith. But one of the things that I want to speak about people of faith is people who, who believe what God has spoken over their lives. They are not just people who believe, but they have aggressive faith. They don't just receive the word, but they believe the word to the core. Today, I want to ask you, is your faith just by words or do you have aggressive faith? Are you radical in your faith? When you look into the man who was a paralytic in, in the Gospel of Mark, we see four people carrying him. When they carried the paralytic to bring him into the presence of Jesus, Jesus, we see there was a crowd in the house and they could not get into the house. So what should they have done? Should they have turned back? What would you have done? Would you have turned back? Okay, there's no way that I can get in now. It's crowded. Maybe Jesus may not see me. Maybe Jesus may have no time for me because there's already people there. But these people, they believed in their core. They believed with all their heart that if they would only bring this paralytic before the presence of Jesus, something would happen. They believed it and not just believed it, they put their belief, they put their faith into action, aggressive action, not just action, but aggressive action. They climbed up that house. How did they do it? I still cannot understand. How did they lift up that man who was a paralytic? It makes no sense. He must have been through so much of pain, so much of discomfort, even to lift him up from down, from, from the ground to the roof. It must have been another discomfort. It must have been a problem for the people, but they believed they believed what they believed they wanted to put it into action maybe I want to ask you are you a person of aggressive faith do you have radical faith do you believe to the core when God gives you a word do you say yes is yes if God has said it he will do it if God has spoken it in his word he will do it would we be people of aggressive faith we look at uh, Joshua in the Bible in the Old Testament God told him tell the priest to carry the ark and the moment their feet touch the water they will begin to cross on dry ground and that's exactly what they did the river did not become dry ground till their feet moved forward they had to put it into action what God spoke they had to do it God spoke it they had to do it God spoke it they had to do it they had to believe what God said today I want to ask you do you believe what God says are you willing to move into aggressive faith are you willing to believe what God has spoken over your life are you willing to act on what God has spoken over your life. I tell you, when you move in aggressive faith, there's things that you will see, the impossible made possible. If God is challenging you to do something, do it. If God is challenging you to move into something, move in it. And I tell you, if he has led you, you will never be disappointed. Be a person who's sensitive to God and see the miracles of God, how it will follow after you. His wonders will follow after you. We need to be aggressive in our faith. We need to keep our eyes fixed on what God has said, because if God has said it, he will do it. I want to challenge you, have aggressive faith and you will see the impossible made possible.